What's up guys? It's been a minute, but we're back. Okay guys, so today's plan is very simple. Hopefully you guys enjoy it, but if not, let us know in the comments. But today we have a mystery tackle box. You might know what a mystery tackle box is, but maybe you don't. There's three different types of mystery tackle box. There's the regular, the pro, and the elite. I went ahead and got the elite. Um, as a car guy, I love cars, but I also love fishing. Um, I got into fishing thanks to this guy. Yeah, I mean, we, we, he, yeah, we he introduced fishing. me to fishing. I never, I never even knew what it was. I mean, I, I knew what it was, but I never had an interest in it. So he showed me, and basically we, we started fishing. It's been like two, three months probably. Yeah, two, three months we started fishing. Um, getting better <laughs> but yeah, yeah uh, the plan today is a little fishing video if you guys like it hopefully we'll do more uh, but yeah we're gonna do a little unboxing of this yeah, go ahead and open it right into the box slick packaging nice and discreet really nice and you ready ready for this go for it Ooh. straight off the bat you see uh, a little dibble mystery tackle box tips and tricks all the explanations about everything um, that you got. This is what you have in the box. Yeah. It tells you exactly how much they are. We got the River 2C Whooper Plopper. The I'm not going to say all of them because... Uh, <laughs> you can read it on well, there. You can read it on there. Take a little screenshot or something. But there it is. And then... Come with the slap, bro. You know. I might put this in the, the charger, dude. I, I, I like it. I don't know if you like it. Yeah, it's pretty sick. All right, well, right off the bat, we got some... Sweet spot tackle. All right, yeah, you wanna go open nice, that up? Nice little swivel baits, bro. They're really slick and good for trout, bass, little smallmouth bass. But other than that, they're really... <laughs> <laughs> so much trouble over here. Now you gonna share that away, what's up? No, get away, get away from the camera. Give me food. And then bam. Damn, look at that. Little nice little swivel bait. Color, coloration on there is like a blue with a little, uh, a black with a little blue sprinkles in it. They're really nice. Let's see, let's see. Get, get that sun. No sun. Yeah, it is. Wait, hold up. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now you can't see it, but yeah, that is so aesthetic out here. All right. Anyways, <laughs> <laughs> all right. We'll put that to the side. Uh, nice. There is. You can kind of see it there. Yeah, nice little swivel baits. They're really nice. All right. Here. Next thing we got. Oh, you want to do yeah, the next yeah, thing? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. All right, boom. All right. We got some, some Great Lakes. Okay, um, I'm not gonna read that, but you can, you guys can go ahead and read that. But I like these a lot. These give me like the little type of warm feel. But look at that. That looks awesome, dude. Nice as one as these, but they have like a little tail on it, so like it'll catch the fish's eye. But that coloration right is here, really nice. It'll catch something. That coloration is so nice. With the blue, bro, that's really nice. When we fish uh, in a bit, uh, and we catch something, we'll tell you what kind of bait we use to catch what kind of fish. Yeah. But we have a little secret spot here. Not a lot of people know about it because it doesn't even look like fishes live there, to be honest. But here you go, the next one. We got some Z-Man 10X Tough. Uh, oh, these yeah. are scented. Yeah. So these might hopefully catch a big bass. Yeah, a little scented black and gold. Uh, yeah, a little. These have good color to it. But let's not. Oh yeah, that those are scented all right. Oh, Look at that. Fish. that. That's nice. That, that's nice. Has a little rivers and dents, so when it swims, it's like more movement, so the fish catches their eye. Yes, sir. All right, now we're getting to the good stuff. Oh yeah. All right, first of all, we got them. Oh, we got the, them J hooks. The, the J's. We got them hooks. These are pretty nice. Yeah, little barbless ones. Oh, right. little barbed on them. Yeah. We got the um, grappy kickers. These are perfect for crappies, panfish, bass, and trout. These are pretty nice. I might use these later. Yeah. I feel like we'll catch something with this. The little coloration is really nice. I don't know if you can see that, but it's like it's like a blue kind of sparkly tint, and it's clear. It's real clear. So that's really cool. We got, what is this? What is this, Lupe? Oh. A little fish for me. I forgot what it's called. It's called a spinnerbait. Yeah, this is a little spinnerbait. This spinner is a spinnerbait. Uh, with the little and indicator with the flash on top. This can catch a 10 pounder, dude. <laughs> I'm telling you. If it doesn't get snagged. <laughs> it, it doesn't get snagged, but I'm not going to use this where we're going to go because it's going to get snagged. Yeah, I know. a lot of rocks out there. So, and, a lot of algae. Um, and I don't want to lose it. It's one of the, the expensive ones. Well, 
expensive, not expensive, but it, you know, you get the point. It has but. like a little value to it, yeah. All right, we got these. Oh, little fly baits, bro. Those are these nice. These are so nice for if you want to just, uh, just um, top water fishing, just if you want to like, if it's crystal clear water and you can see the bottom, like these are really perfect to use. Yes, sir. So I'm like, yeah, you can catch them out. Now we got this little <laughs> Suze 6. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> oh yeah, little little tray hook spinner. Little flash can't even see it that much, but yeah, it's really nice. Yes, sir. All right, now get into the to the good ones right here. This is a oh, cowboy yeah. cowboy top water. Mm -hmm. Nice little bobber fish. It's this, real nice. This is a nice one. <laughs> I'm not gonna take out the box, but uh, maybe maybe when we get to the fishing spot, I'll take it out, let you guys see it. Yeah, but nice. but it's it's really nice. Nice little sardine look-alike. It's real nice. This one is my favorite. I don't know about Louis Go Out, but this one's my favorite. It has a little. That one's little, my favorite. This one's his favorite. That one's my favorite. <laughs> this one's my favorite. No, 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 no. My bad. This is my second favorite. This is my first favorite. All right, show that one first. All right, all right. My bad. My bad. This is Great Lakes um, alligator. Um, it has good color variation. Yeah, and it has like little little tiny like weights in there that like yeah it's, it's good like, for sound and it's good for casting like you could get a really good cast off of that one i don't know if you guys can hear it but yeah, they can yeah hear it. I, I like this one a lot this one this one right here is the whopper plopper this one is my favorite the little tail spins and everything i love this one oh yeah i might try it out today yeah we're probably gonna try um, it on that one Hopefully it doesn't get snagged. If it gets snagged, I swear I'm gonna jump into water. Cause I think <laughs> Cause this is the most yeah, that's the most expensive the thing most expensive in the box. box. Yeah, I'm, I'm debating if I should use it or not. I probably not. Yeah, we'll probably, um, save I'm that probably one. gonna save it till like we go to like a, a bigger lake. Yeah. Uh, well, this is like a creek. It's like a secret spot. Like people knew about it when it was like filled up with water. And now it's just like a little little tiny creek. Mm -hmm. People don't fish in there. But yeah. Yeah, but um, if you guys like fishing content uh like today's um let us know in the comments and we'll do more fishing videos soon yeah bro check um, out mysterytacobox.com you can get one of these for how much you get it for i got my you know you know matter of fact i'm gonna I'm put them in the description i watch one reel one rod um i'm i'm pretty sure that's what it's called i don't want to be this he's probably gonna be disappointed in me if that's not what it is but he always has these he's always making videos and how like he reviews them he catches a lot of fish but if you use his code one rod um that's what it, yeah yeah one rod one reel or something like that you can check his videos he'll have his his code you can get like 15 percent off um and if you want to get the first regular box you can get it only for five dollars yeah real cheap real nice. cheap it's but i got the elite you know i gotta get that that good ones yeah but but like yeah like if you catch a fish you could uh measure it up on here yes sir take a picture of it and um you could post it <clears throat> on his instagram you could tag him with it and just so you have like a little um a little like yeah just to show it off you can actually win money if you catch a big fish Oh yeah, we got your with the bait. Yeah, with, with the, one with of the lures. lures that they came in, like yeah, and you have to take a picture of the lure. Well, not show the lure, and then yeah, catch the fish. You can measure it up on here. Have a, uh, they got trout, bass, and everything else. <laughs> Honestly, like it's it's really nice. It's really cool. Like some fishing boxes don't have like a little um, a measuring thing on here, but yeah, you can check All right, it out. Guys. Well, y'all guys, stay tuned. All right, we just arrived at the spot, guys. Who would love? Lou, Lou Guau keeps hitting me with the rods. Shut up. All right, well, just watch the car too, looking clean, like you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, well, not a lot of people know about this spot, but I came across it, and surprisingly, there's there's bass here. There's spotted spotted bass, and, and the large mouth, that's about all we found. But I don't know, I never expected to see fish here. Uh, on the pool. Like, I like the, the first time I was here with Lupe. I fucking goddamn man, I cussed. I have to put oof again. <laughs> but yeah, here's a little creek. I see movement over there in the water already. But yeah, guys, that would be funny if you fell. Yeah. 
Alright guys, so this is the spot. Yes, it's crap, but A, it has fishes, so we're good. You see any fishes? I see I see splashes in the water, but look, look there's a little turtle right there. A little tortuga. Tortuga. Water's um uh, Look, this is good. A uh bit grimy because it just rains. Yeah. It's a bit grimy, but all right guys well we're gonna get set up and all right guys so we're gonna start with this lure first yeah a little great lakes uh the gupsters so yeah and i have a i got a simple reel rod um i think it's uh 10 pound mono green mono and then yeah i'm gonna use the swivel bait like this up in the head uh, up in the head just go around, feed it through. Should we feed it through? If you want, you can add a little arch to it just to give like a little bit more life to it. It all depends on the person, but yeah, I like hey. a little arch so it gives you like a little swimming thing. Yeah, but this and I'm gonna use this one right here, this blue one. I don't know if you guys can see it. But yeah, blue to gob stopper. Yeah, I was a little kitex. But yeah, I'm going yeah to we'll let you know if we catch anything and which bait we used, which lure. What you saw a fish? Oh look, a little fish right there. Oh, it's a little spotted one. Go, go, try to try to get it right there. Pour it that that way and then reel it in. There you go. He's looking at it. He's looking at it. Nah, he didn't. He didn't like it. Oh, he's coming back for it. He's going up towards the water though. Like that action in the water, dude. I, I like that. Oh, he's going back for it, dude. You might catch. You might catch him. Ooh, I think that's a spot. Uh, that's a spotted uh, little bass. Yeah, you can see them. Oh, well, we we know they they're hungry, so that's good. Hopefully, we catch something, guys, and we'll let you know. All right, guys. Today was a bust. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't catch nothing. We yeah. had a little bit of bites, but no really good and fish on type of deal. And uh, we were uh, out there for about like five, yeah. four hours. Five, five, give or take five or four hours. Power, yeah, four hours. But yeah. Um, we'll be back though. We'll be back, and we when we back. I mean, cause. There's there's big fish, dude. Yeah, there's there yeah there's fish there for sure. But we did like we threw the lures down, but like they didn't they didn't really catch their eye on it. Yeah. Yeah. What was not was not facing at you or what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> nah, but we came to Sonic, you know you know the vibes. We got the mango slushy, but um we'll be back, guys, and stay tuned.